I've been thinking about it really hard, right? And I finally decided that what I want to be, what, what it is that I really want to be, is a test pilot, like. And I've seen this film, I don't know if you've seen it, Mr Thorne, but it's really grouse. It shows you about being a pilot and everything and breaking the sound barrier. And I must have seen it about... Oh. Well, I've seen it once, right, and I was going to see it again, except I slept in. And anyway, that's when I decided that what I really want to be, what, what it is I really want to do is I want to fly a jet fighter plane. Or maybe a 747, because they're real easy to fly, like everything's sort of like computerised and you don't have to do anything, just sort of like sit there and press a button. And I reckon I'd be pretty good at that because I'm not like practical. And I've been practising for the G-forces, you know, hanging upside down on that monkey bar. And my world record is two hours and 12 minutes. And I reckon I could have broken that, except I fainted. And I can stick my head in a plastic bag for three minutes, no worries. Barry. And I've even made up my mind that I'm going to call my first plane Death Cheetah. Barry. Cheetah is in the fastest animal in the animal kingdom. Barry, now, you remember the motor coordination tests? Remember that? Um... The blocks? Oh, yeah. The blocks. You scored 12. Hey, no, I didn't even cheat. But the minimum score required for a jet pilot is 460. Yeah, well, I could have done better, except because, you know, I lost a lot of time at the start when I got that square one caught in the hole. Barry. It sort of threw me because there was no corners in the hole. Barry, you failed woodwork, you failed metalwork, drawing, maths, art, English. You've got bad eyesight, low blood pressure, and you're subject to nosebleeds. Now, how do you imagine that you'll qualify as a jet pilot? Well, I thought, like, if you recommended me, but that wouldn't be fair to you. Ambition's a good thing. I mean, I didn't necessarily want to become a careers counsellor. But I knew that I'd be happier if I was doing something that I was good at rather than going after some dream where I'd probably fail. And are you? Am I what? Happier. I believe so. How do you know? How do you know if you've never done that other thing, what you wanted to do, that you wouldn't have been happy if you'd done it? Well, we can't be sure of these things. I reckon you ought to go for it, Mr Thornton. You ought to do that other thing. Otherwise, you'll regret it for the whole rest of your life. Oh, Barry. It's just like the guy in the film. He knew he wanted to be a jet pilot. Barry, I want you to try and accept the fact that you're not going to fly a jet plane. I'm not? No. How about a helicopter? Because they're real easy. There's just like this one stick lock. So he takes a... Oh.